All right, guys, uh, now that you've uh, scored your figure on the rubric, uh, let's try to improve your figure drawing ability by drawing a human figure. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to draw a figure that is uh, eight and a half heads tall. Uh, this will be a male figure. Um, and uh, we'll, the first thing we'll do is we will put in a center line to show us kind of where the center of our body is. Okay. All right. And the next thing we'll do is we'll put in those heads. And we're going to go ahead and do our best ovals that we can. If it looks like a potato, that's okay. So we'll do one. And then we're going to put half of a head right here. So so it'll be like half of a half of a head. So that's a, a quarter of a head. We'll use that other quarter down at the bottom of the torso. So we got one. We'll label these as we go. There's two. Three. Four, and we'll use that other quarter of a head right here, and we'll go five, and six, five, six. And seven and eight. Okay, they're about the same. That's as good as you need. Okay, let's not beat ourselves up, up over it. All right, so go ahead and we'll put in our neck. And then we're going to be drawing a male figure. Uh, and males have a wider chest because they have more muscle mass than most females. Um, so if we were drawing a female, we would put the heads vertically next to each other to know how thick our upper torso is. But since this is a male, we'll lay the head uh, horizontal here. That'll give us our thickness of our torso. And then we're going to go ahead and put a triangle in. And we'll go down to the bottom of three. And this will give us our upper kind of torso shape. Okay. All right, and then uh, we'll come down and we'll go a little lower than that. And we'll put another torso uh, triangle in here. And we're down to our hat, and this will give us kind of our center area. And in four is where our navel is, kind of around in here. So that's where our belly button is. And we'll kind of have our rib cage between two two and three like right here this is kind of the rib cage and this is your stomach area okay okay it goes a little lower all right and now we will go ahead and go with five and six will be our leg and down to between six and seven will be our knee so this is your femur bone. We'll put a really long kind of cylinder shape here. All right. And our knee is right here between six and seven. We'll go down and ankle will start at the middle of eight, kind of around here. Kind of, kind of a baseball bat shape. Well, thicker than that, like a kid's baseball bat, I guess. And we'll, for feet, we'll just draw kind of a triangular shape for right now. We'll really get really too involved in that. And we'll fill out our torso. This is called drawing through, and you can draw the mechanical lines. You don't need to erase. You're just kind of figuring out where things go. Okay. All right, I have other head, uh, videos about drawing heads. If you want to check them out on my channel, you can just go ahead and put it on a line there for the middle of the head. All right, so we know that our elbow, if you put your elbow into your chest, it'll be about where your navel is. So these, these arms come down about here. Okay, and then if you lower your hand down, 
Uh, it's going to be about the middle of your femur, right about here. So put that other part of your arm down here. For a hand, so easy. Just make a square. Put some lines. Fill it in. You get a little hand. You don't have to worry about it too much. All right. And then kind of fill it in a little bit more. And there we have a very simple, basic, nearly properly proportioned figure. And people are all different, but this will meet a lot of your drawing needs if you could kind of set it up according to this eight and a half head tall pattern. Remember that if I went too fast, you can slow this video down in your player uh, by I think it's clicking the gear on YouTube. And hopefully this video will help you become a better uh, artist because you will be able to draw people even better than before. Thanks, guys.